first tonight, we're hearing from police in Mount Vernon, Washington, after they say a missing team they had been looking for was found safe in West Michigan. News 8's Terry Morris has more on what we know so far. Almost 2,000 miles away from her home in Washington State, that 14-year-old girl was found here in South Haven in a home located along Blue Star Highway. And with her was 30-year-old Keith Freakerson. We first got a report that was missing back on January 6th. Uh, her mother reported that sometime between the night of the 5th into the morning of the 6th, uh, she had gone missing. I would believe that she had gone voluntarily at the time. We have decided not to name the teen because she is a juvenile and may be a victim of a crime. Police learned the 14-year-old girl may have used a ride-sharing service. They were eventually able to find a ride she may have taken. Investigators later identified the person who had ordered the ride who police named Thursday only as Keith. We asked Mount Vernon police how the teen got from Washington all the way to South Haven Township. Started getting a number of tips coming in as to where she might be. And so those tips that had any sort of substantive uh, information that we were able to follow up on, uh, we did. Um, and that culminated uh, on the night of the 30th uh, when we got a tip that led us to uh, focus more on a subject that had been, whose name had been put out there uh, publicly. Uh, by the name of Keith. Michigan State Police and Van Buren County Jail records indicate the suspect is 30-year-old Keith Freakerson. He is listed on the Michigan Sex Offender Registry for 2017 convictions out of Florida's Seminole County, with charges of possessing a photograph, film, or other representation that knowingly includes sexual conduct by a child. According to police, he also has an address near South Haven. So reached out to um, the Van Buren County Sheriff's Office let them know uh, about that information and they were able to go out to the residence and recover. According to online records from Van Buren County, nine charges were filed today against the 30 year old. It includes two counts of human trafficking of a minor for commercial sexual activity, two counts of using a computer to commit a crime, three counts of third degree criminal sexual conduct and accosting children for immoral purposes. Earlier, we also spoke to family of the 14 year old who says they are processing the investigation and working to bring her home. According to police, the family says they were elated to hear the news that she was found. They were super excited, as as you can imagine, uh, not seeing or hearing from your, your daughter for uh, that amount of time would be excruciating. Now tonight, the Mount Vernon Police Department says this is still an ongoing investigation and they are working to learn more details. We'll be sure to keep you updated on air and online at woodtv.com. In South Haven, Taylor Morris, News 8.